Hello friends, welcome to the new session and today's topic will be numbers. We all are familiar with numbers, right? We use the numbers in our day to day activities. In every day, right from the beginning of the day till the end of the day, we always have something or the other to do with numbers, right? So, today we are going to learn more about numbers and many different things which we can use by solving these number problems. So, what do you mean by numbers? When I say the word number, what is the first thing that strikes in your mind? It is the digits, right? 1, 2, 3, 4 and so on, right? So, whenever you hear this word numbers, this is the first thing which strikes your mind, right? So, these are called as countable numbers. So, what do you mean by countable numbers children? Countable numbers means those numbers which can be counted, which can be counted easily using our fingers or with our minds, right? So, they are something which is not very tough to count. When I say uncountable numbers, uncountable numbers means those numbers which cannot be counted easily. Say for example, if I say million, trillion. So, before getting in our mind what is the number, we will actually try struggling, right? We will think how many, what is, what do you mean by trillion, what do you mean by billions, right? So, those numbers are called as uncountable numbers which we cannot count easily using our fingers or our mind. Whereas, the first one countable numbers are something which we can easily count, okay? So, the next thing which comes in our mind is the smallest number and the largest number. When I say smallest number, say for example, if I say smallest one digit number, okay? So, what is my smallest one digit number children? Yes, it is one. So, my smallest one digit number is 1 and what is my small largest one digit number? Can you tell me? Very good, it is 9. Similarly, if I say smallest two digit number, so what will be my smallest two digit number? Very good, it is 10. And what will be my largest two digit number children? Yes, it is 99. Say I ask you what is my smallest three digit number? Excellent, it is 100. And what will be my largest three digit number? 999, yes. What is my smallest four digit number? Very good, it is 1000. What is my largest four digit number? It is 9999, right? What will be my smallest five digit number? Very good, it is 10,000. And what will be my largest five digit number? Good, it is 99,999. So, the list goes on like this, right? So, here we have found out that what will be my smallest one digit number or the smallest two digit number and so on and we have also found out what will be my largest one digit number, two digit number and 